hello everybody and welcome to this channel once again thanks so much for clicking on this video so if you're new here kindly hit on the subscribe button to subscribe if you're old here thanks so much for coming back again so as you're all aware mother's day is fast approaching so in this video i'm going to show you how to design your own mother's day card and insert your mom's name in it and then present it to her using photoshop so without further ado let's get into the video so the size that i'm going to use is a5 so you go to file the new and then it sets an a5 size of course and then you click ok when you are done firstly i'm going to set a soft or a solid color and then i'm going to give it a color over here you can of course choose any color that you prefer so i prefer something like this you click ok when you are done next select your rectangle to enjoy a nice rectangle over here we're going to create something like a frame so up to this area and then we change the color to white like that you click ok and then you press ctrl a to make sure that you have it in the middle like this and then you press ctrl d when you are done what i'm going to do next is i'm going to insert some flowers that i got from google of course you can download different flowers and try them out so i go to my desktop and the new folder over here i have this flower over here you know i have so many over here but i'm going to use this particular one so i'll click place and then it imports it into photoshop so i'm going to use the transform button to transform it smaller like this the flower already has a white background but then i'm going to rasterize it so you make sure that it does not crosses the white um, rectangle that we've already set like that if you would like to use any other background for the rectangle that we have over here you might want to change or remove the background of the flower so but i don't want to change it i want to maintain the white because it looks pretty well so i'm going to make sure that i have it at the very edge of the rectangle and then i'll leave it like that so next i'm going to press ctrl shift and then l to auto level this particular flower and then i'll press ctrl u and give it a saturation of about 20 and then i'll click ok when everything is ready next i'm going to duplicate the same flower send it on top here and then i'm going to press ctrl t first i'll flip it horizontally and then flip it vertically so i'll send it over here so that we have a double portion of the flower like that so you take your time to position it to make sure that it is at the very edge of the rectangle that we just created next we're going to type in the happy mother's day so i'm going to use the font called damien bold and then i'm going to choose the color from the background over here so that it will be uniform so i'm going to type happy mother's day or let's say all right so when i'm done i'm going to press ctrl t to transform it and make it a little bit bigger and then i'll press ctrl a to center it like that and then we trans we can transform it a little bit more like this yeah i think this is cool so next i'm going to select the rounded rectangle over here you remember i told you that we sh you would be able to insert your mom's name in it so we're going to draw the rectangle over here the rounded rectangle over here and then we're going to change the color to the same color over here mind you you can change the color anytime you want you, you are not restricted with one color of course so you just position it somewhere around here and then choose your test tool again and type your mom's name so i'm going to type um mrs diner of Usuhine. that's my mom's name and then you can bring it over here but since the color or the color is the same as the rectangle it will be blended together so we have to change the color to something like white and then i'm going to use a font called acrobat one of my favorites and the type i'm going to use extra bold so i'll press ctrl t again to make sure that it has fit to the rounded rectangle and then you take your time to position it and make sure that it is in the center just like this so the last thing we're going to do is 
select this happy mother's day test and make a duplicate of it again bring it over here and then you're going to type i love you so i love you like this maybe mama you can add anything you want to add and then press ctrl t to transform it smaller like that and bring it down over here so i think here we do and it will look very nice and cute and then lastly we're going to select the costume shape too we have the hat over here we're going to draw a hat a hat for mama and then we're going to change the color to this particular color over here i think it looks good and then we bring it over to the down here let me zoom in more so that you can see it very clearly and then we press ctrl t to transform it down like this and i think it will be ready so like that and we select it with i love you mama and transform it down position it to the left side so that it will go away from the flower and then i think this will be done so you can save this as a jpeg or png or any format that you want to save it and then send it over to your mama print it out for your mama print it out for your wife or any other woman you want to send this to so i would like to take this opportunity to wish all mothers a happy mother's day god bless you so much for your time and everything that you do for us we appreciate this a lot and we pray for more grace and more years for your life so thank you everyone for watching this video please don't forget to like and subscribe and don't forget to watch other videos of mine till the next video i'll see you again innocent here bye